With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, two monochromatic and coherent point source of light are placed at a certain distance from each other in horizontal plane. The locus of all the points in horizontal plane which have constructive interference will be. So if you see for a to, to have the constructive interference, we know that the part difference should be integral multiple of lambda. So, if I say here, these are the two sources S1 and S2. We want the locus of all the points where the part difference is integral multiple of lambda. So, if, if I take a random point, right, let's say this is the point, any random point. So, if you see, let's say this is x1 and this is x2, you can also take it as k1, k2. So, the distance of this point from the two sources is k1 and k2. We want this k1 minus k2 mod to be equal to n lambda. You can put the value of n equals to 1, you will get the first maxima put the value of n equals to 2, you will get the second maxima. So, if you recall this, right, if you recall this, you have studied this, this in math that in hyperbola, if, if I draw hyperbola like this, in hyperbola, if you see the distance of any point on the hyperbola, the uh, distance of any point on this hyperbola from the two focus half constant difference it means if i say this is d1 d2 for any point if you see that the d1 minus d2 mod it will have a constant difference right if i say this as x so it will be constant so basically this is a equation of hyperbola Now, you can check for the option if you put the value of n equals to 1, 2, 3, you will get a family of hyperbola, right? So, basically, B is the correct. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.